Welcome back, everybody, for the India campaign. We're almost done, guys. This should be the second to last video. But we will continue the India campaign with the first shot. Pretty sure Nanib is sick and tired of being sick and tired. How much blood can stain one man's hands? There is nowhere to run as long as I wear this red coat. I am beginning to understand what that boy who was executed must have felt. When you have nowhere to run, you must create a new path. What is this new nonsense? The men refuse to use the new Enfield rifles, Colonel. Then how do they expect to fight the enemy? Find out what all the chatter is about, Lieutenant. Colonel, there is big fat in the rifle cartridges. It is against the men's beliefs to eat pork in any form, so they cannot tear them open with their teeth. I don't care what they believe. Tell them to do as I say, or they will be executed. But, sir... You, Lieutenant, pick up that rifle. Show them how it's done. Sir, it is also against my beliefs to place this cartridge in my mouth. Pick it up at once! Regrettably, I cannot. I am giving you an order, Lieutenant. Pick up that weapon! Yes, Colonel. Why did he shoot that guy? Why didn't he shoot that dickhead Edwardson? Why did he shoot the random Dragoon? <laughs> what was that guy doing? <laughs> oh, man. Resist. Our private war has only just begun, Nani. We will finish this on my turn. We fight with you, Nani. It is time for the company to take our orders. Look! The other sea boys have joined us! Fight, brothers! Fight for your freedom! Yeah, who is this guy, Pravar? I I don't think we've met him before, am I wrong? We have defeated the company garrison and seized the town. I never thought a victory was possible. Um, I guess let's just get our resource crate shipments a rolling. The company command post must be taken at all costs. Without this victory, our rebellion will end here. Okay, so we dealt with that. Um, to be honest, I don't really remember this one. I remember the fourth one and the fifth one quite well. But I don't really remember this one. Okay, so there's a Fort Plano. That doesn't seem like a right name. Um, double Arsenal for some reason. But we are in the Third Age. Uh, let's get a hill fort to defend. What does Pravar have as an ability? He also has the crack shot attack. Wait, let's get a second TC rolling. Oh, hey, it's Axe Hilt. We'll grab discipline sepoys. Oh, that's a lot of elephants. Oh, we need a market. Ooh, actually. That looks like a decent spot for a third TC. Oh. Get him, Axe Hilt! Aw, oh, rip Axe Hilt.
Oh, we got these resource shipments for a reason. Let's actually use them, Ornlu. Yeah, Indians get the first two woodcutting upgrades for free, which is obviously quite helpful. Oh, I just built that goddamn trading post. Wait, do they they have red coats and musketeers, but they have the exact same stats. That's so weird. Um I think we win this. Let's just make sure. Uh, let's get some Gurkha as well, since they mostly seem to be making Musketeer. Okay, we'll get that trading post back up in a little bit. Okay. Oh, that is a water buffalo. The menacing king cobra. Get some more resources. Oh, I miss I miss Lao Chen and his eighty percent melee resistance. Such a good tank. Honestly, I might want to get a mangrove... Mangrove grove? Mango grove? I, I don't remember what it's called. Grove rickshaw. Mango grove. Okay, so it's not a mangrove grove, just a mango grove. <laughs> But anyway, uh, this looks like a pretty straightforward build and destroy sort of scenario. Let's get one of those. Oh. But yeah, they, they got a big old army of uh, a lot of musketeers and stuff. Oh yeah, let's also get a sacred field for cowy cow cows. Hey Amen. That makes more sense. I still like the mangrove grove. Okay, now we're really getting our eco up and running. Give this castle to help protect ourselves. We'll grab Hill Castle too as soon as we can afford it. Yeah, booming with Indians is so weird. Just, I don't know, it's like, uh, goes against all of my... You have to, like, completely reimagine what your, uh, eco-balance is like. Like, you really just need wood. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I made a mistake. Oh, of course, as soon as I use the ability, then they run away. Oop. 
Send you guys out to hunt. Hello. Oh, increases the XP work rate. Sure. Sure. Okay, do that. Let's get Hill Castle. That should help out a bit. Oh, I don't have a consulate. I feel like I don't need the Russian allies as much. So maybe I can think about other ones, but I still end up going with them, I'm not too sure. Ooh, they just reached industrial age. I guess you need another sacred field. Sure, let's get some outs. Lots of food. Get out of here. Okay, we, we can actually click up. Uh, let's get the Karnimata. Let's make it right there, so we can uh, build some rice patties around it, and it'll affect this mangrove. Mangrove grove! <laughs> Always the mangrove grove. Okay, so, um, don't need boats. Plus 10 unit building LOS, plus 5% gather enhancement, those give us us resource crates. Uh, honestly, I still kind of like Russians. Get a rice patty. Hello, Makan Bananewala. Huh? Sahi Lakadhara. Adesh, Makan Bananewala. Don't be stuck. Makan Bananewala. Let's get a stable. I know it's not called a stable, but Caravanasari. Yeah, let's start, just start getting some unit buffs. Oh yeah, and we can almost afford a factory too. God damn it. I'm trying to select 10. So fail. Whatever. Oh, whoops, these guys should go over here. These guys should go over here. Um, I feel like some howdos would be good. I think we should focus on like howdas and gurkhas. Because they like have musketeers, some dragoons, and some cannons. Yes, I will. I am going. Yeah. Oh, you guys go over here. Ah, oh, whatever. Get a factory. So much food. Oh, I'm also running low on house space. 
Здравствуйте. Здравствуйте. Да. Hello. Maka -maka some more barracks. Let's get another caravanasari. I will. I wonder what's over here. It might be a like a back alley route. Okay. Let's get honored Gurkha. Get some howdas. That has 10 gatherers, that has 9 gatherers, actually. Oh wait, okay, 10 there, put 10 there. Get the infinite Howda shipment. Or rather, the Howda shipment that can be sent infinite times. I still like the sound of the infinite howder shipment. Ready. Uh, ninety villagers seems like it's probably enough. Yes, I am. Yes, I will. Hello. Ready. I am going. Anyway, let's see what's over here. Maybe it's a dead end and there's nothing really over there, but... Don't know till you try. Yes. Yes. I will. Oh, I see you guys over there. I am going. Okay, let's be a little bit careful. Maybe have some guys back at home. Also, maybe some more defensive castles would be good. Fall back! Retreat! The gates are too well guarded! What? This isn't that bad. Listen, Nani. The company has a mining operation to the east with access to the port. Oh, okay. So it is a back route. Instead of watching the front, we will slip in through the back. More how does get a fork too? Ah, <laughs> Got him. Hey, Makarunga, may huh? Oh, whoops, <laughs> I need to destroy the gate. The Hello. Huh? Makan banani wala. Look! The company thought its gunpowder would be safe underground. Once more, the whole fort will go up in flames. What's this? Destroy the weapons cache is in the mine. Alright. How was my mangrove grove? Oh, whoops. How are we going to be good against that? Oh, awkward. Okay, good. Oh, whoops. Didn't mean that guy to come so far forward, but sure, whatever. Oh. Um, that's a little bit awkward. Oh, 
Hmm. It worked. The fire is spreading. Well, our own base is pretty undefended, though. The wall has collapsed. Now is our chance. Into the fort. Oh. I guess we just walk in and destroy the command post? Uh, they still have the fort, but um, I mean, we have a bunch of elephants. Howdos aren't as good against buildings as the other elephants, but they still have 85 attack. Like, that's not anything uh, too shabby. Hackapal. Oh, look, they even have the East India Company flag. I think. We have taught the company a grave lesson today. One it will not soon forget. Yeah. It is a new morning. Men and women stream into the streets to join us, and every face is a joyous one. Is this what I have been fighting? What I have been hoping to stamp down into the dirt? No more. Today I lead a new army, an Indian army. Look at how many have joined us, Nanib. We cannot fail. The war for independence has truly begun. But we are an army without a leader. You will be our general now, Nanib. I never asked to be a general. I am a lieutenant in a non-existent army, nothing more. The cry for freedom is spreading. Bahadur Shah of the Mughal Empire has declared himself supreme ruler of India. The Shah is a captive of the company. How does he expect to lead us from deep within a prison cell? It's simple. We will turn our rage on Delhi and free him. If it is the will of the people, then I am at their command. Oh boy. Our men are with you, Lieutenant Nanib. But our meager force is no match for the company. Really? This is our army? This is our grand <laughs> army? <laughs> And avoid the patrols until we can find a way it's into It's Nanib Pravar and three sepoy. <laughs> okay, uh, this one is one of those, like, you have to dip, dodge, and dive around the, the patrols. Noise might spook those elephants. If we are lucky, they will be our battering rounds. Oh yeah, the riderless elephants. 1,200 damage with six splash. Yeah, I remember this one. You have to run around and destroy these weapons caches, and then the explosions will spook the elephants, and then they'll run and <laughs> get a path for us. And don't these guys join us? Okay, yeah. We are with you, Lieutenant. Private Walsh. <laughs> oh! Oh, uh, Private Morrison, you guys done goofed. Oop, these guys? Super dead. Be free, Elephantos! 90% melee resistance. Look for more elephants. By harnessing their strength, we can break any wall that stands in our way. Okay. Have to figure out how to sort of thread our way through. Uh, yeah, they have Imperial Musketeers. They have full upgrades. And we have no upgrades. So I think we can swoop de doop in that way. Oh, wait. Oh, uh, I forgot about this. Wait a minute. That's the Union Jack with the kind of like the American style uh, bars, red and white bars. Okay, these say British. The other ones, I think, it just had the Cross of St. George for England. Oh, yeah. Here it's the see, it's the just the Cross of St. George. It's not the Union Jack. It's the flag of in England, not put, uh, put in with the Scottish cross. I forget the name of it. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I wonder if we can attack from the other side. 
Also, I don't think the elephants can kill you. Get him! For a free India. Well, those sepoy were in the wrong place at the wrong time. Shoot it! Shoot it! It's heading right to the gates! <laughs> nope. Splat. Wait. This is a city, not a circus. Move more troops into Where do the elephants go? End this uprising. Okay. Ooh. Hopefully they can't see us uh, breaking in through the back. Honestly, we could probably bite these guys at this point. Especially once you get these other sepoy. Ooh, those guys all together, probably not. Where are they going? Oh, can we thread the needle? Thread the needle? Shh. Damn it. Oh. Fighting between sepoys and the British has broken out inside the fort. We must get through the gates and turn the tide. Uh, let's read the rest of these sepoys as well. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. It's the Agra Fort. Even though we're in Delhi. Then wouldn't it be called the Delhi Fort? I think Agra is where the Taj Mahal is. I mean, it's not too far away from Delhi if I recall correctly, but I could be wrong. So, I don't know if they train units, but let's just clear out the production buildings just to be safe. This guy is mega stuck. Rip. Oh, we have a Rajput. I don't really know what his weapon is. It's like a... a glove that's a sword? Awesome. Are there still more? Oh, there's just this one. I think. Yep, sorry, dude. Oh, one more. Trying to stay out of range of the Agra Fort, even though it doesn't do much damage still. You don't really get to train any units or anything, so you have to be a bit more careful. Okay, yeah, we got all. We got everybody. Damn, the thing's got range. 26. But we have 28 with our elephants. Oh, this doesn't have that much HP. Only 3,500. Yeah, 400 damage per shot. I think that's like the same as a falconet. But obviously with a better range, way more HP. Although I guess less range resistance. And it costs 7 pop, which is just insane. And is pretty expensive too. So, I don't know. Oh, hey, it's the Shah. Oh! And the Siege Elephants. Target the rocket. Oh, 
Yeah, this guy is the last shot of the Mughal Empire. I remember that. I'm pretty sure he has a rather sad story. I don't remember exactly what it is, but I think he... I mean, he spends, I think, most of his life as a prisoner and dies in captivity or something. What we're doing right now is... The Seaplay Rebellion is a uh, ultimately unsuccessful rebellion. We must escort the Shah to greet his subject. When the people see him, they will rise up with us and fight. I mean, now we get a pretty good army. Oh, I see. We're, we bring the Shah to the flagged area. We have to get out of the city. But yeah, this is going to be a pretty big fight, and we're going to need to, I think, get the Shah to go to everybody. Let's use our buff. Yeah, now we can start fighting these patrols. Okay, there's another one for the shot over here. Making sure there's no enemies in the way. Um, where's Naneeb? Just having him scout a little bit. Wait, how do we get over there? Huh. I am going. I do not remember. Ready to battle. Oh wait. Gunpowder stores? Come on. I am yes, yes. Get him. I hope those one okay, they don't damage me. Maybe they do damage me, I don't know. Um, hopefully... Oh, there are red coats here. Are they actually running away? No, they're just getting stuck. Oh, I see. Hope they don't kill the people. Oh no, the elephants would never kill the uh, the Indian people. Oh, are they gonna trample all these guys? That'd be pretty sick. Yeah, buddy. Oh, maybe these guys too. Can they get them? Oh, well, they got one. Oh, what? And they just disappear, of course. Okay, so we'll bring the shower over there. Uh, maybe I have to go around this way to get to that one. But yeah, taking out those outposts and a bunch of those soldiers was quite nice. Our army is growing! Where are you guys going? Where on earth are you guys going? Mekarunga. Um, we can take these guys. Especially with Naneeb's aura. And I guess technically we can try and, like, dip and dodge fights still, but I feel like, you know, if it looks like we can take the fight with pretty, you know, pretty few losses, it's better than them, like, eventually, like, grouping up or something. Because we are going to have to have some sort of final fight through the gate here, and that, you know, the fewer troops we face there is the better. Oops. Huh. 
Where are you going? So I do want to make sure Nanib has his aura for the last fight. Oh, whoops. Oh, I guess my army's too big. Just take that fight. Ooh, there's another weapons cache over here. Maybe there's some more elephantos. Yeah, let's see. Oop. Oops. Uh, so there's a couple more over there. But yeah, maybe the elephants can help us out here. If there are any. There are no elephants here. What was the point of that? Maybe it's like a difficulty thing. Like... If the elephants just charge through here, that would just like instantly win us the scenario, so it's probably not there on hard difficulty. If I had to make a guess. Anyway, our army's pretty massive at this point. Let's focus the rocket with the siege elephants. Let's focus... What? Attack! Why is this so bad with the pathfinding? Get our aura. Oh, these guys are almost dead. Oh, they're both dead, in fact. That's fine. One more rocket. Good, good, good. Remembered, for this is the day we set our nation free. Sorry, you have to wait almost a hundred more years. Eighty nine more years. A fort wagon. What, they really didn't notice all those people there and all that gunpowder there? Those guys are blind. We have shown that we can defeat a regiment. But what of a whole army? We will face that challenge when it is necessary to our goal. And what exactly is our goal, Pravar? We shall march on the British and pry them from the landscape. Perhaps. But our fight is not with the British. It is with the cursed company. And we will engulf it in fire and make them wish they never set foot in this country. Yes, and I know exactly where we should start. Oh, man. All right, guys. That is the end of this video. And next up will be the final actual campaign video before we go to the historical battles. And uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.